Hi there. Are you getting bored with short sentences in German? Well, have I got a solution for you. Use subordinating conjunctions. For example, weil and wenn. Don't know what subordinating conjunctions are? Well, a conjunction is a joining word. And when it's subordinating, that just means it sends the verb to the end. Let's look at two sentences which we might want to join together. Ich höre Liebeslieder. I listen to love songs. Ich bin traurig. I'm sad. We want to join them and say, I listen to love songs when I'm sad. So the beginning is the same. Ich höre Liebeslieder. And we put a comma at the end. We insert wenn. And in the second clause, we have to send the verb to the end. In this case, bin. So it becomes, wenn ich traurig bin. Let's look at another example. Ich höre gern Hip-Hop. I like listening to Hip-Hop. Es hat einen tollen Rhythmus. It has a great rhythm. Let's try combining these with weil, because. Again, the beginning stays the same. Ich höre gern Hip-Hop. And then we insert a comma. The verb in the second clause is hat. And this needs to be sent to the end. So it becomes... Weil es einen tollen Rhythmus hat. I like listening to hip hop because it has a great rhythm. So now you can create a much more sophisticated sentence. Now in case that wasn't exciting enough for you, I've got one more tip. How you go about beginning a sentence with weil or wenn. Use our first example again. Ich höre Liebeslieder, wenn ich traurig bin. I listen to love songs when I'm sad. Let's see what happens when we want to reverse it and say, when I'm sad, I listen to love songs. So we need to flip the clauses around. Look what happens when we do that. Wenn ich traurig bin, höre ich Liebeslieder. In the middle of the sentence, we create a verb, comma, verb pattern. This is the rule when we begin a sentence with weil or wenn. So give it a try and ask any questions that you might have. Viel Spaß!